all this money on this nice camper and you bought yourself a surge guard or a surge protector. You spent a lot of money on these things like I did. I have the surge guard RV powered model 34850. This is a great surge protector, protector because it tells you many things that could potentially go wrong with your hookup. Now, once I, or twice on, on occasions, two times we've had this thing tell us we've had an open fault, or open ground rather, a, sh a display default due to an open ground on the uh, campsite, and it would not let us fire up the camper. So it does protect you in that way. Flip side of this, these things are expensive. I probably paid $350 in that neighborhood for this particular unit. I'm overcautious and I wanted to do it all. So in order to protect that investment, it came with a small padlock, a plastic pad case that locked right here. And it is easily accessible just by breaking this plastic case that came with it. Matter of fact, I ordered extra. I ordered extra, so it was a waste of money. So I found these online, these master lock Python cable locks. And I came in a box of four. So you get one cable lock, master lock cable lock, and when you open it up, this is what you get. One long cable, a set of keys, they're all key alike, and it seems to be working pretty good. It tells you which way to run the cable, so you can't go wrong. So what I've done is I've got the bottom one on. I'll take this, wrap it over, pull the lock tight. Just like that. Take my key out. And bam, it's gonna be tough. You can tighten this up much like a um, zip tie but again it's gonna to be tough to take that off easily without some issues and um, hopefully somebody wants it that bad they'll be a witness to it or they're just gonna give up go to the next one if somebody wants the one that bad but the, again these are expensive these are a heck of an investment $300 a piece so I got a four box of these cable ties came through Amazon I think I paid $49 for them. So a minor expense for such protecting such a great investment. All right. So hopefully that helps you out in the decision making on how to secure your surge protector.